Hey, welcome back to my show. This is Spencer Colvin from Spencer Colvin with the Wallpaper. Thanks for joining me. This is a quick tip, and it's about heat on commercial vinyl. You know that in order to get commercial vinyl laid down, we need heat, okay? And working out air pockets, we need heat. The heat that you choose may come in the form of fire in a torch. You may choose the yellow can. You may choose the Coleman um, camping torch. Whichever one, you know that fire is a good resource to get the stuff to lay down quickly. And you know you have to be careful with it. But some of us choose to use the heat gun. Sometimes people don't want you using fire in a place, or you may have too many people around and the fire is no good. Um, whatever the case is, you can use either a gun or the torch. Now the torch, I, I'm sorry, the, the gun is the subject in question today. So I have two types of heat guns. One is from one company, the other from another company. I'm going to highly recommend that you stay away from this thing because I think it's dangerous and it could cause you an injury. Check this out. I just put this on for about 50 seconds. First time I used it. I am not using this again. So I was putting up my vinyl and I, I had recourse to cut around that corner up there. Just right now, it just happened right now. And I went and I used this monster. Now, as you look at it, you can see that it's brand new. And why is it brand new? Well, it's my second replacement on this Chicago electric power tool. Now, one day I needed my heat gun. I didn't have it on my truck because it was at another job. And so I ran to Harbor Freight and picked up this, this heat gun. I've replaced the heat gun, I don't know how many times, this is at least the second replacement on it. I, I do not rely on this gun. I wanna show you what happened. So because I just replaced it this morning and needed the heat, I said, let me see how the thing works. I left my go-to heat gun in my truck and take a look at what happened at this thing. After the first use of about 50 seconds, the thing started smoking. If I didn't turn it off, I think it would have turned on fire. Now, what I just showed you in the clip just before this one was from a cold start. The thing wasn't hot. I just, you saw it happen live. Uh, prior to that, I wasn't videoing. I had it up in my hand and started using it. About 50 seconds, shut it off. Things started smoking from the front and from the mechanical fan. So let me suggest the, that you actually don't use that tool, although you might find the price of $35 attractive. It's not. Each time it has gone out on me has been on a ladder when I need it. Don't buy it. Here's what I use. I have featured this on recent videos. This is my Wagner 
like it comes with its own warranty, but after the warranty expires, you can get a one year extended warranty. It says for free. I've never looked into it. This thing has, I can go up to a thousand degrees on this thing. You wouldn't need that for wallpaper. And it has, it has all these attachments to funnel the heat and direct it more uh, in a more concentrated area. So, Wagner, uh, I think it's so popular, it doesn't need my endorsement. It comes in its own nice carry case. And I highly suggest that you take this, put it where it belongs, and get yourself one of these. Thanks for watching. Stay safe.